Hello everyone, welcome to this new episode of Revit Boost. Today we have a new type of videos. Uh, in this video, we're going to explore the new generative design feature in Revit 2021. And we're going to see how it works from both Revit and Dynamo. So here I have a small model where I put some, some things for a cabin and let's see how it works. So I, in my manage tool, I have the create study and explore outcomes. So when I open this, I have like three examples that uh, they put there. One is maximize window view, three box massing and workspace layout. So I'm going to just try the first one to see how it works. I open this, I call my study test, one, and then, okay, so I have some inputs, I need to put some things, when it loads, so for example, let's calculate from this sofa, and then Okay, let's calculate the windows, see the type of windows that we have. And something that I find new that the multiple select in Dynamo now, you can just finish. It's not like before when you do the selection, it's done. And then we select our room. And we like select our obstructing elements. So I'll just these, everything just to see and then okay now this one this one this one okay then we press finish and so we have our selection and then we'll view to outside score maximize Uh, so this one, okay. And then we just uh, try to generate. Wait a little bit. So the right now find like, okay, three, four, six products so far. Six of ten. Okay. Let's wait, wait. Okay, so right now I have like three possible scenarios for the what I want to put in re regarding the view thing. So for example, okay, I think that one is, I have my here my room. Well, it's a bit rotated and then, okay, let's see. So I have this one. This one seems to have a lot of view, in theory. So just let's say create Revit element. And then go back to our model. So, <laughs> well actually it's kind of primitive, but it means that this position for the sofa grants more visibility. So for example, I can just Change this one. Maybe something like that. Well, putting that one. Okay. right now well may work or may not so this is just to know how the generative design works in the next video we will learn how to make the same thing using dynamo and how to create our own studies Okay guys, that's it for today. Hopefully you liked this uh, first peek on generative design. And don't forget to like, subscribe and visit our website.
Thank you.